Jolie here for seconds out, joined by Josh Kelly, obviously another big fight for you, December yeah. the 2nd. Talk to us about how happy you are that another big fight is around the corner for you now. Man, I can't wait, can't wait to get them little 10 ounces on, get in that ring and um, start moving about, I can't wait. <laughs> yeah. What does it mean to you to be back on, obviously your headline, your last mm. fight in Newcastle, it was a good night, but back on a, a big show and uh, in the North East as well. It doesn't get much better kind of a rivalry fight that this is being mm. built as. Yeah, it's good mate, it's good. It gets the juices flowing, it makes you really think about everything you're doing. Um, six weeks, I think it's six weeks, five weeks on Friday. It can't come quick enough now. I've, I've, been, I've been training, I had, a, I had a couple of weeks off, but I've been training since, that last, since the last fight, knowing that this fight was going to be made. And um, just getting ready, getting everything ready, sharpening the tools and I'm, I'm enjoying everything about the sport now, so I cannot wait to get in that ring, like I said. That is really good to hear. Why do you take this fight? Because in boxing, it was mentioned at the yeah. press conference, boxers sometimes go the easy route, mm. so that, like you even said, you want to get to the world title mm. shot uh, as soon as possible. But why do you take a fight like this then? Because for boxing fans, it's a great fight and it makes sense, but not all boxers will, will take the, the route that might end up harder. Mm. I know I win, that's why. I know I win, 100%. I know I win. Um, I think Troy's, a, he's a, he, I respect him. He's a hard working, tough, hard, hard guy. But skills, boxing skills at the end of the day, that's, that's what it comes down to. And over 12 rounds, I'm a better fighter. I'm a better fighter is in the art of fighting, hitting and not getting hit than Troy, yes. So is that, gonna, is that what's going to. Is that what's going to be the deciding factor? Yes. So that's why I took the fight because it's a good fight. I like to be in big fights. I like to get my name out there. I like to be in them fights where you get a little butterfly before you go in the ring. Them are the fights you need to be in, boy. You can't this. You don't want to just be cruising through and then get found out. I want to have these little tests on the way up. So I know I'm, I'm verified when I get that top. Yeah, that completely makes sense. Um, is this Sunderland versus Newcastle thing? Is this going to be part of the build-up? Obviously, you're a big Sunderland fan. Is, is this yeah. real? The, the clash of football teams, or is it just something that can be uh, used? Listen, I think Troy's from Darlington, so <laughs> um, I think he just stuck the Newcastle top on move. For people I, who don't know, it's not yeah. technically in Newcastle. No, it's, <laughs> it's like just past Middlesbrough. But I've always, I've ne when I was younger, I never really followed football, and um, footballs grew. It's it's going on us like since I, when I when I first turned professional and stuff I never really followed mm -hmm. I, I didn't know I, I didn't know you couldn't I couldn't tell you who was playing who where and when I was just in, in the North East I was like oh it's a big game that's a big game I didn't obviously if I had to support a team my son and the, the team I play for as a kid and the team obviously the city me my family grew, grew up in they're still there my nan and granddad my mum dad everyone you know what I mean so of course it'd be something but now that um, now that I have sort of really grew into that sort of thing, I mm -hmm. think a lot of friends have uh, from something have pulled us back in, and have, uh, yeah, it's good to have that com like camarad is it camarad what's what's it camaraderie yeah, I think it, yeah, <laughs> and I like I like I like the mentality of people back in back in their team and being loyal to it, win lose draw draw I like that mm -hmm. mentality so. Could it be a Newcastle Sunderland thing? I'm not sure. It's in Newcastle. I guess he he, he was trying to draw him some support having the Newcastle top one, but mm. listen, I'm I'm Sunderland, so but I th I guess I'll have a lot of supporters there from the Sunderland Sunderland, but I could go in there fight night and just have and just go into the lines then, and I, sometimes I prefer that gets your juices flowing a little bit more. Talk on that a bit. Yeah. So well, just going into uh, the lines. Yeah, then. I, I like I like it. I said the other day was talking about someone's talking about tickets and I said give give all my give, give <laughs> it says let him why don't we just fight with all his fans in the thing and just me versus him <laughs> in the thing I don't know I says like I, I walk in there but I, I, the support is unbelievable what I get and I appreciate every second of that support it's unbelievable but is that going to win your fights it never does me doesn't win your fights it's, uh, what, what wins your fights is going in there and performing and I perform I, I, I love it when the chips are down and I'm going in there and I've got to really back it up so yeah I'm really looking forward to it December 2nd of course how does the best Josh Kelly turn up on December 2nd because like you said you're confident of the win yeah. of course just enjoy myself bro just enjoy myself go in there with a big smile on my face and put a performance on really appreciate your time Josh my good brother. to speak to Thank you, you.